We're breaking down two of the most asked questions online right now. First, can the vice president invoke the 25th Amendment? According to our Congressional Research Service report, Section 4 of the 25th Amendment allows the vice president to, quote, assume the powers and duties of the office as acting president. Now, it only requires that the vice president have approval from the majority of the cabinet, but if the president challenges, then two-thirds of Congress would have to approve. So technically, yes, the vice president can invoke the 25th Amendment. But it's never happened in U.S. history, and that same Congressional Research Service report indicates that the amendment was, quote, not intended to facilitate the removal of an unpopular or failed president. Second question, was this the first time the U.S. Capitol was stormed and seized since 1814? A lot of claims out there about this. Now, while congressional records show minor attacks in the last century, none of them involved more than a handful of people. The kind of large-scale breach and takeover of the Capitol we saw Wednesday hasn't happened since 1814 when British troops stormed Washington and burned the Capitol. So this claim is also verified. Now, folks, there are tons of claims and rumors online right now. If you see something you want us to check out, send us an email. With your Verify, I'm Jason Puckett.